So my God, it's CJ.com. Hey guys, this is Kuhn Jeff from ZomaGodCJ.com. And this time around, we're going to take a quick look at messaging on Symbian 3. Um, as you can see, Symbian 3 does introduce a new conversations view, which is uh, much appreciated, but there's also the same uh, inbox view and um, other basic arrangement of things. Um, the conversation view, of course, is very useful for you to view a conversation uh, between you and somebody else. For example, um, let's take a quick look at how my uh, network provider sends me random crap, uh, like you can see right there. Um, but yeah, it's 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 pretty useful. Uh, you can actually see what people have sent you. At the same time, you can tap a, a reply to them right there, um, and then type something and send it when you're done. Uh, you can, there's also new emoticons in uh, Symbian 3, which I know will keep a lot of people happy because um, there are a lot of very cool emoticons uh, that you can see right there. So that's um, that's very cool. You can see it's a little tiny da guy doing things there. So yeah, um, that's very cool, I would imagine. Um, and you can just type stuff in just like that or choose to delete a message from there. Um, you can also send, add uh, recipients to it, attachments to make it an MMS. You can call the sender, um, go to editing options, uh, and choose your writing language, of course. Um, but this, of course, is portrait mode. In landscape mode, depending on what you have installed, um, I have swipe installed on my N8. So you can um, switch between swipe and this. This, of course, is the normal keyboard that you can see right there. Uh, where you can manually type things in like that. So yeah, so um, that's as you can see, it's not that great. Uh, I made a little bit of a mistake there, didn't I? Uh, so yeah, um, the keyboard on Symbian three isn't that great. I'm I'm a bit hesitant about it because um, I find typing on my iPhone or Android phone better. Um, the keyboard does take a lot of getting used to, but it's nice. It's not bad at all, and there is swipe. Um, which is very popular that you can install on that. Um, so yeah, it's not bad. It's not that major either. There is, of course, um, copy-paste. Uh, there's predictive text and a whole bunch of settings that you can turn on and off right there. Um, what else is there? What else is there? Um, yeah, so um, there is uh, there there is a lot of improvements with Symbian 3, as you can see right there. Uh, typing is a lot easier. For example, text input is a lot easier. Um, not major improvements as such, but the conversations view is very nice. Uh, it will really help you keep track of those conversations. Uh, as usual, the same old um, things from the previous versions of Symbian is right there. You can save drafts, uh, get delivery reports, see your sent items, uh, tap a new um, a new message with, where you can just add uh, all sorts of attachments that you can see right there. Um, and choose to send it to a contact or a person. So um, so yeah, so that's uh, that's messaging on Symbian three. As you can see, it's um, not dramatically changed a lot, but a lot nicer than previous versions of Symbian. Um, if you are a more detailed look at this, do check out our post on the blog. Or if you have any questions, do let us know in the comment section below.